Madonnas, welcome back to the channel. I'm Valitra and I'm the Crafty Black Girl. So you guys, today I will be showing you guys how I am repackaging this car wash basket that I actually created for Father's Day. So I had a couple left over, so I'm going to go ahead and throw them into a wrapped box and i'm gonna go ahead and put down that shred and reposition everything in this box you guys to make this look like a holiday gift basket so i'm gonna go ahead and put that air freshener underneath and i'm going to attach the wipes to the side of the box that way when i stand the box up the wipes will not fall so y'all i actually forgot that what i wanted to do was make this look a little more festive so as you'll see i'm going to pull it back out and i'm going to go ahead and attach this garland so that it looks more like a holiday themed gift basket so then i'm just going to go ahead and wrap that garland around i actually got that from dollar general for about maybe 30 cents and so yeah i added it all the way around and of course i'm putting it back inside of this shrink wrap bag you can use shrink wrap just a roll if you have that but this is what i had so now i'm going ahead and tie that up at the top and i'm going to shrink wrap it and make everything tight make everything look really neat and then it will look really really good when we stand this up so now i'm going to go ahead and i'm going to cut off the excess of the shrink wrap bag and make a little fan and then i did make this bow by hand guys if you want to know how to make bows head on over to birth embosses with felicia you will learn how to make bows and so much more so you guys i really loved how this bow came out and i was so glad that i had this color because it worked perfect with this gift basket so then i tied the rest of the little ribbon in the back and you can attach a price tag here if you want or just cut it off like I did. So you guys, one of the other things that I've started doing is making sure I write down all of my items, how much they cost. That way I can come up with how much to charge for this. Now, this formula really depends on you. And sometimes I adjust it just based on, you know, how I'm feeling. So it shouldn't be that way, but that's how I do it. So I added up the price of the items. And then I think for this basket, I literally just doubled it i really want to get rid of some things so i'm actually taking some of the prices down and i ended up doing this one for 40 dollars. but another thing that i'm going to do is put an item description so that when people buy the basket they don't have to ask me what's inside so this is the finished look for this basket you guys leave it a thumbs up if you like it it's actually a gift box and so yeah if you liked it leave me a thumbs up leave me a comment down below and until next time stay crafty